Hi, hello, welcome to my channel Bini's World. Today is my topic about the snake plant. It is also called as Sensevaria. This is a very hardy succulent plant. It is low maintenance plant can be grown by the beginner very easily. Watering can be done monthly once. It's the best air purifier plant. At the bottom of this plant, along with root, ribosome will be there. So, plant can propagate with ribosome also. Today, I will show you how to pot the plant with the help of ribosome. Repotting, I will show you. It's very easy. Just take a garden soil to this. Add a soil on the root. And just tap it uniformly carefully pour the soil around this plant this is the another type of snake plant which is completely in a form of green color a small leaflet has been broken in this snake plant even after I have kept aside for one month it has not damaged or rotten. See how fleshy, thicky these leaves are. This plant requires no fertilizer. Its propagation is very easy. Take the leaflet and just cut in a 2 inch size. I have taken two leaflet which has broken from my mother plant and I will cut you in the small pieces. I have taken the life with this. I have cut this leaflet. We have to sterilize the life with Dettol. We have to give a mark. It should be placed on up direction and the lower part should place at the lower direction so at the bottom a new roots will form after three months we have to be very careful while putting this leaflet pieces it should not damage we have to place it very gently we have to give space between the leaflets why because a new plant will grow from this leaflet so i have kept that much gap now after placing all the leaflets we have to press it gently and then we have to pour water this is another type of snake plant which is having yellow border this leaflet is having a length of three to four feet it's very strong plant even if you go to any tour, we can leave this plant as it is. After one month also, it will be very well. If you keep in the garden, the plant will multiply with the help of ribosome. Why? Because ribosome will creep on a ground. See how with the help of ribosome, the plant has been grown in the ground. It takes a lot of place to form a plant. Another way of propagating this plant is with a complete leaflet. At the bottom of the leaflet, there is a white color is there. With that white color, new root will form. So we have to place that white color into the soil. Then we have to transfer this leaflet to the pot. I will show you how to put into the pot. It's very easy. The white color which is present at the bottom of the leaflet that we have to press gently into the pot. After three months, new plant will grow. If you like my video, please like, subscribe to my channel Bini's World. Thank you one and all.